right, so you're to fasten the fuel shutoff valve is on. So I can collect the friction. Coming off. Collector pedals free, throttles free, collective pull down, <coughs> frictions on. Cycle so collectors, frictions on, pedals are neutral. Rotor brake is disengaged. Circuit breakers are all in. Car heat is off. Mixture is full rich. Mixture guards installed. Landing lights off. Avionic switches are off. Clutch is disengaged. Altimeter is set to field elevation. Governor switches off. Okay, so it hasn't been, I don't believe it's been flown today, so... This one has not been flown today. Do you only give this one two or three? I usually give it two. Okay, they, so should, they should only need two. Two. Roll into D10, verify closed. <clears throat> Good. 
runway 28 left, RNAV, CPS approach, CNU, landing, 8, flying runway 28. Hazardous weather advisories for California and coastal waters available on flight service frequencies. Car Use caution for increased wildlife activity and birds in the vicinity of Hayward Airport. Notices to airmen. Construction tower light out of service. Okay, RPM drop a needle. Caution for multiple Good. cranes in the vicinity of Hayward Airport. For further First information, Frank, check notums. Advise on initial contact via India. Hayward Tower information, India, 1950 Zulu, wind 280 at 8, visibility 7, days, sky clear, temperature 20, dew point 1, Our temperature 20, so 226, 235. Runway 28 left, RNAV, CPS approach in use, landing and departing runway 28. Hazardous weather advisories for California and coastal waters available on flight service frequencies. Use caution for increased wildlife activity and birds in the vicinity of Hayward Airport. Notices to airmen. Construction tower light out of service. Caution for multiple cranes in the vicinity of Hayward Airport. For further information, check notice. Advise on initial contact via India. Have India. So, uh, what are we looking for? We're looking for a uh, left downwind departure to, is that how you do it? Palo Alto. Yeah. To say left downwind departure to Palo Alto. Yep. And what have you forgotten to do? Well, we're going to do our oh, power check here. At one and a half feet. There you go. Yeah, it's about two feet. Here. All right. Point two. Pulled some power today. Oh, the car beat up, huh? Oh, no, he didn't. Please do the request to approach. 
Uh, Typically, you want to do that power check right where you pick up. Oh, right. Cause it, yeah, because then if you need to shut it down, you can just lower it and shut it down. I've had to do it twice already with these helicopters. Meaning what, if you don't have enough power to, to basically uh, no. operate that day? It could be that, or it could be, uh, like, I actually had the manifold pressure because we had a stuck valve. Oh, when you had the stuck valve. Yeah, yeah. Five, four, seven, two, ten, all the manifold pressure just went real high, way high. Yeah, all of a sudden you pick up. Because you didn't have enough power. No, no, it's just that you had a stuck valve, so uh, all of a sudden your manifold pressure just went whoa, freaking cranked over to 30. But had I not done that hover check and just picked up and started taking off, I would have had to set it down right there and just been like, well, come move it. <laughs> oh, Roger, okay. hold for arriving trap. Hey, we're Teller, helicopter 479 or hotel at Meridian, requesting a left downward departure to Palo Alto with India. I got the 479ers here at Hotel Hayward Tower, stand by. Uh, 025, extend your downwind, I'll call your base. Traffic will be holding in position, Cherokee. Clear left for right pedal turn. Here. Cessna 025, just copy. For a second. Cessna 025, extend your downwind, I'll call your base. Traffic will be holding in position, Cherokee. Set down when you call the base guy, clear 025. Cherokee 72, Tango, runway 28, left off the line, please. Line for 28 left, uh, 2 down. In Turkey, 72 Tango correction, runway 28 left at Zulu, line for way traffic in a downwind Cessna. Line for 28 left at Zulu. Cherokee 72 Tango, make left downwind departure below 1000, still Highway 92, runway 28 left at Zulu, clear for takeoff. If this were golf airspace, we'd be out of here already. <laughs> oh, yeah. Helicopter 479 Sierra Hotel, make left downwind departure below 1000 till Highway 92. Taxiway Zulu be Meridian, clear for takeoff. Taxiway Zulu be Meridian, clear for takeoff. Left downwind departure approved, remain under 1000 till clear 92. 479 Sierra Hotel. Thank you. 025, base turn approved, number one, runway 2A left, clear for the option. Base turn, number one, 2 left, clear for the option, Sky 025. Right, clear right for left hill turn. All right, lights on top of the green, three in the green field. Cartier. Hey, watch that airspeed. We're still very close to the ground. You're going 60 knots already. Okay. So it's about 40 you knots. Mean climb, climb before you get yeah before you get too to much 60. Airspeed. Remember, at 40 knots is where you want to start pulling power. Right. But you're safe to stay be close to the ground at 40 knots. But once you get higher, then yeah, once you get higher, you want to be start get into the shaded area. The exactly high velocity curve again. All right, clear left, center, right left. Bridge are we 
going down like Dumb Dumbarton or yep. the Dumbarton. Okay. So he'll kick us over uh, just before we approach Coyote Hill because we're going to be getting out of the uh, the Delta. Okay. And then we can get the weather change over, and then when we call him, uh, we'll call him with with the Atis and. We'll be over Coyote Hills as our reference point. Okay. Here we are, Chapter Five. Chapter Five, here we are. Chapter Five with you, uh, seven miles out to the east, southeast, uh, inbound with India, uh, Texas Alpha, Hangar Three. Chapter Five, here we are, one able item. Second. And Chopper Five, here we are, one able item. I did Chapter Five. Chopper Five, I didn't observe. Make sure you're going to start heading out. three miles out. Straight in for taxiway off over port three out, Chopper Five. to go aft on your cycling too. Oh, okay. Yeah. Those three steps, so you got to lower the collective, that's correct. Okay, remember, you're trying to get that charge back kind of right away. Frequency change approved for Sir Narrative Hotel, thank you. Okay, so your ATIS is already up, you're good. Go ahead and switch that. Contact, you have information, Charlie. And 18.6 is your uh, next frequency. Hello, to tower information, Charlie, time 19047 Zulu, wind 350 at 9er, visibility 6, haze, sky is clear, temperature 20, 2.13, altimeter 2996, six. GPS approaching east, landing and departing 1831, bird activities on and in the vicinity of the airport, hazardous weather information available on flight service frequency, feedback of hold short instructions and runway assignment is required, advise ground control with departure request, advise on initial contact, yes, information, Charlie. Charlie. Hello, to tower information, Charlie, time 19047 Zulu, wind 350 at 9er, visibility 6, haze, sky is clear, temperature 20, 2.13, altimeter 2996, GPS approaching use, landing and departing 1831, bird activities on and in the vicinity of the airport, hazardous weather information available on flight service frequency, feedback of hold short instructions and runway assignment is required, advise ground control with departure request, advise on initial contact, yes, information, Charlie. Um, Hello, tower information, Charlie. Time yep. one nine four seven Zulu, wind three five zero. Okay, so I'm going this way, haze, but clear, I'm temperature two zero to the east. 12. So when I call them, I say I'm. Or just tell me over Coyote Hills. Just tell me over Coyote Hills. Yeah. Landing and departing seven miles. Coyote Hills. Just tell me over Coyote Hills. Hills. Oh, yeah. Okay. Airport. They know Coyote Hills. Weather information. Go and switch over. Flight service frequency. Over we're not out to Zulu. Short approach approved. Wind three four zero at nine or runway three one fifty. Okay, what am I asking for? Short approach approved. Uh, tell them you're uh, inbound for what? Thank for the spot. Inbound for the spot. Yep. Okay. Over seven four five. I'll call your base. Uh, you will call my base. Uh, the number seven four five. Over number seven two Tango. You number two following a Cessna a beam you on the opposite downwind report. We have them in sight. They're going to be executing a short approach. Runway three one clear to land. Land up to Government one Alpha Juliet, taxi back via Zulu each time around this frequency of Boston. Try not to overfly the hills. Oh, okay. Hello, Alpha Tower, helicopter 4790 Sierra Hotel, six miles uh, over Cody Hills at 1000 inbound for the spot with Charlie. 
0479 Hotel, follow out the tower. Make right traffic for runaway uh, for the uh, spot. Landing at the spot will be at your own risk. Confirm we send information, Charlie. Affirmative, we have uh, information, Charlie. Uh, right, right pattern approved to the spot. Uh, landing at own risk. 4792 Hotel. November 745, turn base at the amphitheater. Uh, turning base at the amphitheater, uh, November 745. So typically I like to fly along that road out there, that dirt road, oh. instead of this. Okay. There's less people out there, because people over here, because this is a NOAA area, so it's requested that you, if you're going to fly oh, over your 2,000 2, feet. feet. Yeah. Okay. Um, not only that, but there's no there's flat place to really land down there if okay. you have an issue. Cut across, or should I follow no. the road? Go ahead and follow the bridge. Okay. The nice thing at the very least is that this is all shallow water. Yeah. <laughs> Cessna 9 or Hotel Zulu, one able turn right crosswind. Uh, right crosswind, A7 at Hotel Zulu. Helicopter 9 or Sierra Hotel, continue southbound along the Dumbarton Bridge and enter the left downwind for the spot. Left downwind for the spot, continue along the Dumbarton, 4792 Hotel, thank you. Series 1 Alpha Julia, runway 31, correction, no, hold short, runway 31, traffic landing. Also 31, uh, Dakota 611 Alpha Julia. Okay, so oh, I'll just keep here. going this way. Yep. Okay, so I'm I'm downwind now. So Niner Hotel Zulu unable short. By the way, engine failure. failure. Setting downwind to follow the skycatcher. This is not good. Understood. Uh, That's why we're trying to cross the bridge. It doesn't friggin' matter. At least you're close to a bridge. Okay, we're ending up in the drink if, you, if we have an engine failure right now. I mean, you could turn back and get there. Dakota, one Alpha Juliet, runway three one clear. Right up until about. So they call three one six one one Alpha Juliet. Cherokee 72 Tango, on Zulu contact ground. Well, and plus there's those, those wires right there that I have to get over. Yep. Two mile final, so. runway three one clear for the option. Number two, three one, clear for the option. Eight seven nine, hotel Zulu. So what's the uh, what's the EP if you have an engine out into the water? Uh, you just auto and then you just roll it over to stop the blades and then try to get out. Try to open the door before you. Oh yeah, we'll open the door before before turn you hit the water. Off. Oh okay, unlatch the door. Yeah, and then turn everything off. Yeah, turn off your master battery and stuff. Turn off your ele your electrical. Wait a minute, where's my airport? To the left. You have it in sight. Oh, okay, over there. Yeah, like over there, 10 yep. o'clock. Okay. Uh, no. Yeah, not this. There's a water inlet down there. Yeah. See this little point of land right right here close yeah. to us? Yeah. Okay, and then past that, there's like a water inlet. Yeah. That's the airport right there. There's a, do you see the golf course? Yeah. Right next to the golf course. Oh, okay, next to the golf course. That's right. Okay, so... Dakota, 1 Alpha Julia, traffic over the Otter Bridge. I cross here then. Helicopter, then. Nope. 1 turn right cross. I'm sorry. Keep going. Okay, keep going. Their runway comes straight out this way. Okay. We haven't crossed their departure yet. You see the traffic? That's. Oh, yeah, okay. Just turn across. Yeah, okay, I see the runway now. Okay, so yeah, you can go and follow this guy down. I'm just going to enter the kind of straight in downwind then. I'm, just, uh, I'm so like basically doing left face right now. Not base, but crosswind. You're doing crosswind right now, left yes, crosswind. but go out to the 101. Oh. You go, you go ahead. Just so follow. follow this road. Yeah, just follow that road to the 101. Okay. You see the 101 from here? Yeah. Okay. Dakota, one off at Juliet, number two, follow us up, now one mile final, round with two, one clear for the option. Yeah, for the option number two, three, one, and traffic in sight, it's going on off to this. He didn't give me clearance to land, right? He just said... Uh, he said it'll be uh, landing at your own. Oh, does that mean...
Typically, the spot that usually, uh, I mean... Yeah, helicopter and Niners here, hotel, you can proceed direct to the spot. Remain south of the extended center line. Landing at this spot will be at your own risk. Landing at the spot, don't risk. Proceed to the spot, uh, remain away from the center line. 4790, hotel, thank you. Attention all aircraft, a traffic helicopter landing at the spot will remain south of the extended center line. South of the extended center line. So right now we're south. Center line? Okay. So we're just making sure. Oh, we're right okay, I see. Because the spot is yep. south of the center line. And Tower Helicopter 9 Sierra Hotel uh, request, uh, would, we, would, we, yeah, would you be able to accommodate doing a few patterns uh, from the spot left traffic? Helicopter, Niner Sierra Hotel, affirmative. Uh, remain south of the extended center line at all times, and uh, landing and departing at the spot will be at your own risk. And just report each go from the spot. Left traffic approved. Okay, report each go from the spot, and uh, it'll be at our own risk, and uh, we'll remain south at all times of the extended center line. Helicopter, Niner Sierra Hotel, thank you so much. Okay, so where is the spot? Go ahead and turn right. left and start descending. Okay, lights on. I'll tell you what, I'll do this first one for you. All right, all right. Okay, I got flight okay, controls. Okay, you'll control. Uh, I got them. The dish 2500 at Chattery Landing. So you see that porta potty over there? There's like orange. Oh, okay, right over there. Yep, okay. That's where we're going. Enter, correction. Uh, remain out of the way. Oh, yeah. Over 1500 and overfly midfield. So, this is as good of an off airport as we can get. Okay. There's people there. Okay, so I'm doing a normal approach as best I can. Because this is real life scenario. This is where the helicopters park here. Icy controlled. I'm going as normal as I possibly can. And then at the end, I'm going to have to go into a steep approach, right? Oh. So, our Hotel Zulu, right crosswind at Otter Bridge. Flat crosswind at Otter Bridge, A7 Niner Hotel Zulu. Steep. Oh, okay. And I'm going to go all the way to those oil spots up there. Okay, Sky Kaiser 745, runway through, I'm clear for the option. Uh, runway through, I'm clear for the option, Sky Kaiser 745. My wind direction is 350. I'm going to turn into the wind a little bit here. And I'm at the spot. Takeoff here. How do we get out of here? It's a steep approach or uh, max performance. So again, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna do this first one for you, and then the runway is uh, three one. Yeah, runway's over there, going that way. Okay, so, so I'm, gonna, I'm gonna I'm just gonna, gonna, gonna do this first one for you, okay. so you can see everything. Okay. I'm just gonna get light on the skids here. We're doing max performance. Every time you get out of here, you're gonna have to do max. Get the call, or you just take off and then call. I'm gonna call and let them know. Oh, okay. Follow up, Tower Alex Nine Zero Tells. Let me go. Niners, yes, uh, Niners here, Hotel Sagan. On the go, helicopter Niners here, though. Yeah, Roger, thank you. So, guys, I, I gotta clear all this stuff yeah, here. Because these, cool. these are real obstacles, right? Right. We're clear of them now, so I can go ahead and do a normal takeoff. And so, typically, what I do is I go left of the tower. Okay. Helicopter Niner Sierra Hotel, uh, traffic uh, off your left is entering midfield left downwind altitude indicates a 1,400 Cessna. Okay, look for that traffic helicopter in Chirto. Traffic site on Chirto. He's directly up our 9 o'clock there. He's up high. Uh, so that Niner Hotel oh, Zulu, make a wide left 360 uh, sequence for a short approach. Okay, so. Okay, we'll make a wide We'll climb up. I usually climb five or 600 feet. Uh, and nine, then what I'll do is I come out to right here. And then I turn out to the 101. Okay, pass two, and that's pretty much it. Wing up right so you got flight controls? Alright, I have control. You got it. Looking for the sky catcher, so go out to the 101 again. Yep. The pattern like five, 500. It's typically 500. <laughs> So try to square yourself off, because right now you're kind of doing an oval, yeah. and that way you have time so you can get an actual downwind, because right now you didn't, you never really gave yourself an actual downwind. Okay. Because you're going to start turning in, kind of by the tower. Okay. Traffic right, traffic 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 helicopter, new downwind is landing, and the departing at the spot will remain south of the extended center line. So remember where you got to go. 
to pay attention to how high you are, right? It's, this is essentially an off airport. It's a confined landing. Our hotel Zulu uh, traffic to follow is a mile and a half final now, so uh, just make uh, one more uh, standard rate of turn left 360. I'll set you up for a short approach. Zulu left 360, A7 and our hotel Zulu. From Dakota, 1 Alpha Juliet, hold short, runway 31, traffic landing. Hold short, 31, to call on all through this. Catch your sum four five pounds ago, left on Bravo. Uh, left on Bravo. Let's get catch your sum four five. Okay. Alright, so I have a question for you. How did you feel being that low, going that slow over all that stuff? Um, yeah, we got too slow. Yeah. <laughs> For that, for that altitude, yeah. So that's why you want to kind of be uh, a little bit, because again, it's a normal approach, and then at the end there, then we could just slow it down and then do our steep approach. So, because yeah, we were just so low that if we had an engine failure, we were going to the rooftops there, right? We, like, we didn't have a choice. We wouldn't have been able to even try to go anywhere else. So, uh, which, there's a lot of shit there, and you know, if it were to go south, then you're kind of screwed anyways right there. Okay, well, so when, um, Where would you where would you start slowing down then? Um, like it's I well like I said I do a normal approach like basically up into those trees. I'm a normal approach until I hit those trees, and then I'm a steep approach after that. And then slow it down. Yep. Okay. Which I mean you're still 35 knots something like that you know 40 knots up to that point. Up to that point yeah, and then I start slowing it down and bring it right down here. So. Okay so just. Yeah, because I just slowed down a little too soon, so maybe slow down like over the trees. Yeah. To get to like ETL. Yeah. Get the ETL like over the trees rather than. Yeah. 100 feet back from there. Yeah. Okay. Let's try that. Um, uh, take call before I lift up then. Uh, yeah. Get yourself light. Let's get ready to go and then. Uh, Skycatcher 745 uh, would like to terminate Sky, take uh, Yankee 1. Uh, Skycatcher 745, affirmative, uh, hold position there, you can contact ground. Uh, we'll contact ground, uh, Skycatcher 745. Hello, it's the tower, helicopter 4790, hotel on the go. Yeah, so on uh, on days where uh, we want to work on steeps, I found that this spot is really good. Uh, and I only came over here the first time because I was doing a photo, uh, oh, uh, photo survey. Shoot. Yeah. And so we had to land here for fuel, and I'd never been over here. And so ATC had to talk me all the way in because I'm like, I don't know where the spot is. So he talked me all the way over to it because it's not on any chart. It's just a just a yeah, flat yeah, area. Yeah, it's like parking. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, uh, yeah, it doesn't say the spot on any of the charts. So, uh, 
really recommend Yeah, I came in and I was like, oh, this is awesome. <laughs> and so now I've been taking students over here and it just really helps so that way you actually get that visual of how you actually use this in a real environment, you know? Yeah. There you go, and you square it off. Sky catcher 745, follow up on Dakota. Watch right your climb. Right, go. What's that? Watch your climb. Fire lights on top of the green, three in the green, fuel, car repeat. And so just like you're off airport, you can start your descent now. The Niner Hotel Zulu, short approach approved, runway through and clear for the option. Runway through and clear for the option, short approach, A7 Niner Hotel Zulu. So keep some forward airspeed. We're not at the trees yet. Now is where I would start my steep approach. up then. Oh, we're gonna pick up and go anyways. Okay, that was better. Um, let's try and put our skids on the on the line. Okay. So let's do a steep all the way down to there, because right now we're gonna coming down and doing a little bit of a step down. Do it again. Go to one Alpha Julia. Base approved runway two and clear for the option. Base gives the option three one six one one Alpha Julia. Cessna Niner Hotel Zulu. Right across from that train bridge sequence for short approach. Cross one at Cranbridge, A7 Nano Hotel Zulu. Palo Alto Tower, Twin Sessa 717, Tango Victor is holding short, uh, Yankee 1. Twin Sessa 717, Tango Victor, Palo Alto Tower, hold short, runway 31. Or to hold short, runway 31, 717, Tango Victor. Palo Alto Tower, helicopter 4790, Sierra Hotel, uh, on the go, remaining south of the center line at all times. I think in an exam, the only time I actually had to use, like aside from just demonstrating that I could do a steep approach, the time I actually had to use a steep approach was to clear a bush that was like six feet tall. <laughs> oh, oh. Okay. Yeah, I just don't have trees. But the areas that we were landing in were just these hit rolling hills, oh. kind of like the hills that are out in Livermore. Yeah, there's just nothing. Yeah, kind of like that. Like in training, we'd be down by the river. And like Helicopter, Niner Sierra Hotel, traffic upwind to head to your right. Altitude indicates uh, 600 Great Lakes is uh, left Dumbarton, so we'll be uh, turning left cross when it be the Dumbarton Bridge. Looking for traffic, 47 Niner Sierra Hotel. It's not that biplane, it's not that, that plane strikes. Uh, it's all Sour Helicopter Niner Sierra Hotel, is that uh, that biplane that's taken off? Helicopter, uh, Niner Zero Hotel, uh, traffic no factor. No factor, Niner Zero Hotel. Is 
Delta. And under Hotel Zulu, short approach approved runway through and clear for the option. He just said no factor. Short approach approved. Zulu so active with option A7 and under Hotel Zulu. Oh, I got this other guy, I think. Uh -huh. He's still, that guy's still climbing up, so I have no idea. <laughs> Alright, lights on top of the green three and the green fuel car P. Traffic over slack and bend to Palo Alto, altitude indicates 2,900, descending Centurion. Centurion 077, traffic over the Dumbarton Bridge, turning southbound, altitude indicates 1,500, uh, climbing uh, Great Lakes. Yeah, it's that, that my plan. Oh, okay. He's starting to make a left turn. So I think right now, like, it's a little shallow, the approach right now. Yeah. So again, we kind of want to keep that normal approach profile. All right, so here, we're now we're in normal. Yeah. Centurion 077 traffic, 11 o'clock, four miles uh, southbound altitude, and it hits 1,700. Suggest you continue your descent to Palta. Copy, still looking, 077. Like Great Lakes 3 Gulf Lima, traffic at 12 o'clock and 3 miles, altitude indicates at 2,500 descending. Great Gulf Lima, we're looking. Hey, we're still over these trees. Alright, so get past the trees and then start. Uh, 7 Tango Victor, keep the upwind Cessna off your right, right down Barton, right way down that line. Go. Roger, keep the Cessna off my right, clip the off runway 317, 7 Tango Victor. Dakota 611 Alpha Juliet for straight out uh, departure to San Carlos. Dakota 1 Alpha Juliet, expect straight out. Nice All smooth rough. peanut butter. <laughs> All rough. <laughs> rough on landing. Okay. Um, so, yeah, again, like I said, on the way in, it's just uh, it's keep it going. Keep it going until you're past all those obstacles. I mean, we still have a tree and a you know, or we still have a fence in front of us, stuff like that, but it's like at least we're past all the tall stuff. Yeah. And if something happened right there, we should be able to make it past the fence and at least get onto the asphalt there. <laughs> oh, okay. Right. You're saying. <laughs> but oh, I see, because if you slow down, like, oh, I don't know how to bear speed to get past all that. Exactly. Exactly. When 320 at 10. And I'm going to come down at a steeper angle anyway if I'm doing the. Essentially, yeah. Really right. Yeah, you got no. You, yeah, so keep your forward airspeed until you're over something that's decent to land on. All right. So. All right, let's do one more. Oh, Great Lakes 3 Gulf Lima, traffic no factor, altitude, your discretion, frequency change approved. Hello, so tower, helicopter 47902 Hotel, on the go, remaining south of the center line at all times. 47902 Hotel. So for your radio calls, all you need to do is let them know you're on the go. Oh, okay. Because we already let them know that I we know, know to I stay know. south. Yeah, so. I know, I know. That's a sun on our hotel to do make a left 360 sequence for short approach. That's 360, left 360-87, Dakota 1 Alpha Juliet, frequency change of room. Frequency change of room, this one on Alpha Juliet. Twin Cessna 7 Tango Victor, contact NorCal departure 125.35. Arthur 125.35, have a good one, 7 Tango Victor. So I think next flight, we'll go out and we'll do some uh, off airport uh, approaches. Okay. Be like engine failure. Or just... Oh, we'll probably do that today too. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There's still time. Okay, good. And then maybe do some. Oh, I was kind of reading something like, oh, I'm not really supposed to be doing the slip that low because I'm supposed to straighten out. I think maybe you were mentioning that. Yeah, about 200 feet is where you yeah, go. So then, yeah, so they're saying, oh, S turn's probably better at, like, if you're too low. 
Yeah, it depends on how low, but 200 feet is basically where you want to be straightened out and ready to go. So you can... But it depends on how much of a slip you're doing. If you're doing a little bit of a slip, that's not it's, that it's fine. Right, but that's on top of the green. Probably more, far more advanced if you're going to be doing a slip low. Like it wasn't until CFI that my uh, the DPE that loved to show me slips. Yeah. He showed me like even how to slip in a uh, in a flare. <laughs> okay. That's too advanced for me. Well, that was CFI is when he <laughs> showed it to me. Just uh, nine two Zulu rolling through and clear for the option. Show for approved. Clear for the option. Two one. Shot approach approved. Eight seven nine two Zulu. Too slow yet, though. There you go. Now start slowing it down. And now you're going to do that nice steep out of the line. How kind of when we uh, when I mentioned like now slow down and go ahead and start descend, you kind of slammed on the brakes again there. So you don't need to slam on the oh, brakes. Don't just do start. Yeah, just start. Nice right. and gentle. Come back. All right. Uh, let's request a uh, right crosswind departure uh, back to Hayward. All right. Palo Alto Tower, helicopter four seven nine two hotel, requesting a right crosswind departure back to Hayward. Helicopter nine nine two hotel, departure from the south will be at your risk. I'll call your crosswind. Park your own risk, you'll call Crosswind, 4792 Hotel, thank you. Palo Alto Tower, Cessna 7480, Papa, holding short, Yankee 1, ready for departure. 7480, Papa, Alto Tower, hold short, runway 31, landing traffic. Hold short, runway 31, 80, Papa. Once we get about a beam the bridge, is usually where they turn us out, but sometimes it's earlier than that. All right. Just a uh, here, Papa. Just uh, hold, continue holding short sure of the runway through and expect about a one minute delay so I can get a helicopter across the left to right uh, departure. And... Yeah, you might call us earlier. Roger, we'll call. Hey, there, Papa. Helicopter 902 Hotel, traffic on to your right, Cessna, and right close traffic. Behind them, right cross approved. Right cross and approved behind the Cessna, 4792 Hotel, thank you. Oh, I'll the tower, Bonanza, one seven zero on the Papa, five out. Bonanza, one seven zero on the Papa, off the tower. Take straight in with three one, clear land number one. Clear land number one, three, straight in, three one zero on the Papa. So you got the nine zero, they'll be right close to traffic. Keep them off your right. Keeping them off my right. Four seven nine zero, hotel. Thank you. So I got the excess uh, eight zero Papa left down with three one, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff on three one, six eight zero Papa. I kind of thought that's what he meant, but I understand how, because I was like, oh, yeah, that makes sense, cross behind him. So this is 729 Echo Lima, Star, pull Pinal Turret, runway 31. Pull Pinal Turret, runway 31, 9 Echo Lima. Just 9 Echo Zulu, turn crosswind. Turn crosswind, 87 9 Echo Zulu. Uh, Nana Kalima, right 45, right 31, clear for takeoff, I'll call you right 45. 
clear for takeoff. You'll, you'll call my right. Sign up. I got the manager out there. Frequency change is your discussion today. Frequency change approved. Four seven zero two. Thank you. I guess that means I can do my right crosswind. Yep. And Tower, Helicopter 9, Sheriff, uh, I just want to say thanks uh, for uh, accommodating us and let's practice uh, over there at the spot. It really helps a lot. Thanks, Sheriff. Helicopter 9, Sheriff, no problem anytime. <clears throat> okay, uh, I got you here. 1267. Hayes, I clear. Average 22, 2.12. Altimeter, 299.5. Visual approach running 211 East, right, probably 28. Notice, Chairman. Power obstruction light out of service. We've talked for obstruction training in the airspace. Internal aircraft hazard is flood major for the California available on flight service frequencies. Live in initial contact, you have information, Julia. Get information, Juliet, 20500, 127088, visibility 8, A's, back base, average 22, 2.12, altimeter 299.5. Visual approach running 211, east ramp, probably 28, no. Are we just going to go to the uh, practice area for a while, or are we going to go back? Uh, I don't know, let's go that direction. Well, where's your wind coming from? Internal right. aircraft hazard is flood major. We're 50 minutes near our flight, by the way. What direction is your wind coming from? Actually, it's the west, so it's actually that way. Back a little bit. <laughs> <That way>. <laughs> <laughs> now I just kind of follow. Oh, if follow I, that if road. I was you, I would follow that road. Yeah. All right. So. Needle seven the traffic. Uh, just north of the field is about your one o'clock, a mile and a half of Baron on right base, 1,200 descending. Inside. Needle seven, Roger. You can resume on navigation. It's reserving Needle seven. Keep following the road out that way till I'm clear of the. Yeah, that's, hill. that's typically what I like to do. All right. All right, Mike Delta is uh, number one. Have to go. Affirmative. Engine out, engine out, engine out. Roll that throttle off. Catch that charge. Catch that charge. Where are you going? We're going straight ahead. Any Mike Delta contact ground. Mayday, mayday, mayday. Hell, we got the 4790 serial tail. Honestly, they reach off with you when my straight left Alpha 1 cleared for takeoff. Two souls on board. Two souls on board. All right, go and recover. Eagle 7, frequency change approved. Recover. Alright. Nice work. I'm going to start giving you worse and worse places, by the way. Oh. Yeah, that was pretty easy. But I gave you a smaller place than I gave you last time. Station and T Delta <laughs> do extend out on the half mile. Traffic starting from full length as a Pilatus. Runway 2 8 last clear for the option. Extending downwind, 2-8 left, clear for the option, 2 Delta Zulu. And you got to remember that the better locations, the better routes that you take, yeah. the harder it's going to be to set you up for a shitty location. So you got to consider that as well. Okay. Right? Because if you decided that you were going to follow just in the middle, straight over the water, then it's like, okay, you didn't give yourself very many spots. We're going in the water. Yeah, exactly. 
More like, oh, I'm going to try and land on this little strip of land. Yeah, good luck. To do a right cross with departure on the go. Good Delta Zulu, Roger. And base is at your discretion on the go. Right cross on departure approved. Meaning, during the check ride, keep that in mind. Uh, What's that? Go, Keep sure that in mind. You should be looking for places. Yeah, exactly. Along the way. And choose your route. That's going to be kind of better. So, yeah, you can just call them and let them know that we're uh, over Coyote Hills inbound. All right. Dude, what was the... Uh... Authority 8, A's, right clear. Average 2, 2, 2.12. Altimeter, 2995. You can go this way a little further. Approach right, 211, east right, probably 28, notice, Chairman. Power obstruction light out of service. You caught for obstruction screen in the airspace. Internal aircraft hazard is flood major port of the California Bill 1 flight service frequencies. Live initial contact, you have information, Julia. Air Tower, helicopter 4790, hotel 5 miles at Coyote Hills at 1000, inbound for Meridian with Julia. Helicopter 4790, hotel Tower, enter a 3 mile final for taxiway Zulu report, turning final. Three mile final for Taxiway Zulu. Report uh, three miles for Seven Nine Zero Hotel. Thank you. Yeah. So anytime you can set yourself up like that, because of, he's going to give you an engine out at some point. Yeah. And depending on who you go with, uh, you know, like I said, I like to call engine out. Um, he might just roll off. IDPE's called engine out. Well, he's going to tell you how he's going to do it. Oh. Okay. Right? Um, so, like, can. Ken likes to just roll off. Or I think he rolls down your till till you get a lower RPM horn and he expects you to enter an auto from there. Oh, okay. <clears throat> um, oh, so he's not really going to say engine failure. He's, he's going to roll down, oh, lower running warning horn. Exactly. Because he's going to, I think he's going to tell you, according to Brendan, he's going to tell you, I don't do low rotor RPM. Oh, okay. so he's not going to do that. Yeah. It looks like there was a deflated uh, birthday balloon that blew onto the extent threshold of 28 left. So each DP is different. Two Delta Zulu, so, thank right. you. Uh, that was a two Delta Zulu. That's uh, seven Tango Lima. Affirmative. But yeah, if they give you an area where you have a choice to be like, oh, I got this is nice clear path, the, then yeah. Just to the right of the Always Zulu take Alpha it. intersection, or uh, to your right of the Zulu Alpha intersection. Correct, just on the, uh, yeah, exactly, on that side of the runway. Just don't look at your DPE and go, Pff, that was easy. <laughs> Oh, no, I wouldn't do that. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay, just wait. Yeah, they were like, oh, really? Don't get cocky. Okay, so would you like to remain on the left or change to a pattern work on the right? We can remain on the left. I just thought I'd... Do, do they, what, does he want me to do, like, a left base then for... She told you left base. Yeah, she wanted me to left base. And you're three miles. I just stand by one second. Hey, we're Tyler Huxley, 4790, Hotel 3 Miles. Hotel 9, Hotel Roger, continue. Series 257, Tango Lima, make left close traffic, runway 28 off the Zulu, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, runway 28. Better read that back. 257, Tango Lima. Just continue, because she's busy. Okay, so I, I'm going this side. I'm gonna actually do a final rather than go through the. Okay, that's fine. I don't know what the, what does she want me to do. Yeah. She, didn't, she didn't really say. Oh, I think she said straight in for. Uh, or can I do straight she in? She didn't say enter base or anything like that. She just said straight in. She just said final. Yeah. Helicopter nine zero hotel. Taxiway Zulu will be Meridian clear to land. Taxiway Zulu will be Meridian clear to land. Four seven nine zero hotel. Thank you. So yeah, so you should start really paying attention to like, I mean, over the road and stuff like that, but also start really paying attention to stuff out here, right? Because you know you're gonna be flying over this stuff. So before your check ride, right, like now, yeah. look at all the open fields you have. Okay. Pay attention to the routes that would be best that have the most open fields and the least amount of power lines. Okay. All right, so I can make it there, but the wind's better there, so I would probably go there. If, uh, you, could but I'm a little if long. you could make it there, yeah. I'm a little long. You could make it there. I can make, make it there now. You could make it right turn. I'm a little, 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 little long, little long, a little long. Got an open I can hit courtyard this. right there. This is kind of sketchy with the light post, but it is. Uh, I'd, I'd probably go for the field. 
probably make it to the field. I probably make the field. There's light. There's big light poles on the football field, so that's probably not so good. But I can make it to the soccer field now. I can make it to this field in front of me. All right, lights out top of the green, three in the green fuel car. Feed. Yeah, big parking lot. Obviously, there's a lot of obstruction in there, but there. worst comes to worst. I can make it on the street right here. Remember, parks with kids and streets with cars are typically it's not, not so good. Yeah. Get downgraded for that. <laughs> you're going to run into something where it's going to be like, well, I guess I would. Like, where would you go? Well, I guess the only place I can go is the I street. Can make the parking lot right now. Get So that's where, remember, uh, altitude is your friend, right? I'm like, hey, I got, I got enough time. I got enough altitude to go over there. So, like, if you guys are going east of three crosses, climb up to 1,000 feet, or if they give you, you know, they tell you 1,400 feet, keep climbing up 1,400 feet if that's what they let you, right? Oh, okay, more altitude. Yep. Gives you altitude more time. For the option, yeah. and then you caution for the balloon. We're going to get someone up there shortly to. Uh, Answer that. Roger, runway 28 left, clear for the option, Saratega Lima. the yellow line. I would I would follow right here. Oh, I see. Technically I should follow that. Yeah, technically. I mean like okay, so if I'm doing like the the check ride, like I should follow this. Hey, what's up? Uh -huh. yeah. You get bonus points for that. Yeah. It depends. You might be like, where are you going? <laughs> it's like I'm following the Taxi yeah. line. And then it ends right here. And then, yeah. They say, okay, where are you going now? I don't know. Right base, runway to eight right, report uh, racing. Up the line, the line ended, so I'm just going to, I'm going to clear all the expensive aircraft. I'm going to go between, I'm going to stay away from the expensive aircraft. Two miles west of your position, proceeding northeast on the space near 3000. And I'm going to put it back where I got it. Two seven Tango Lima, Roger. Down, hold down to 70. I'm here with Tara, I'm in the grass now, I'm in one light, I'm to accept the recovery balloon. Airport maintenance. Airport maintenance, one here, so you can proceed on runway 2 left at Alpha for the balloon. Maintenance, one proceeding on 2 left at Alpha, thank you. I'll pull up a little bit on that. Do you have it in sight? In China. I do not. Uh, once you get on to the runway, it'll just be off your left near the center line past the interse intersection there. Or actually, since you're on Alpha 1, it'll be just before the Alpha intersection. Roger that. Uh, keep it out of the yellow there. There's 7 Tango Lima, extend down and I'll call your base. Go road to resident. Do call our base, uh, 7 Tango Lima. Chris say now, did he, did he say go middle of the H or he said just go two minutes? No matter what. And he actually hasn't really said anything. I've seen middle of the H on some things. I just always go two minutes. That's the way I was trained to do it. All right. It's kind of six of one, half the other. Okay. Hayward Tower, helicopter 442, Bravo November. 
Helicopter 442 Bravo November Hayward Tower. Helicopter 442 Bravo November coming up on Cal State to the northeast at uh, 2100 inbound for landing uh, Meridian with uh, Juliet. Hey, they're bringing us our helicopter back. Who? Chris and this woman. Oh, the 444? Yeah. Helicopter 442 Bravo November Hayward Tower Roger into a right space for taxi Zulu traffic at your 1 o'clock about a mile and a half also inbound towards Hayward. This is Cessna descending out of 3,400 for that traffic. Suggest a left hand turn of about 20 degrees. How's the cadet? Behind. It's really nice. Turn really good. 20 degrees yeah. and we're making a right base. A lot of power, I think. To uh, Meridian and uh, traffic is safe. Robin November. Robin November, thank you. Same engine as the Raven. Raven 2. Continue. Raven 1. It's the same as the Raven 1. Yeah. It's, a, it's a carbureted. Yeah, it's carbureted. Six cylinder. Okay, straight up here. 257 St. Lima. And uh, here we turn, maybe it's one and a half spot and clear for the left, thank you. Hello. Prime Minister, and Roger, thank you. Clear 7, Tango Lima, runway 28 left, clear for the options. Runway right, 28 left, clear for the options, turn to Lima. Two is Tower, Cessna 67849, 3,000 feet over San Ramon Hills, requesting closed uh, traffic with Juliet. Cessna 67849, right. Roger, fly towards Cal State, right base, runway 28 left, report over Cal State. Good work. How do you feel about that? city it's too dangerous there's too many there's too many people too many things can go wrong it's training you know okay so it's not gonna be I mean he's gonna have a spot picked out that he's thinking oh that would be a good spot I wonder if he'll, he'll notice it exactly and that's usually what I do and I know with Ken from what I understand he typically well he gave Brendan his over there somewhere out in the near the hills he gave Paul his over here and the big thing that he was looking for was giving him a very wide open area turn into the wind the biggest thing he's looking to make sure that you turn into the wind when he gives you a big wide open area like that oh okay so it's like okay well you had plenty of spots that you could have picked so why didn't you turn into the wind right because that's why paul didn't one of the reasons paul didn't pass the first time oh he was doing fine it's just that he didn't turn into the wind he didn't turn into the wind like, there was a, there was something else too that happened but i think it was the vor thing um, but then, yeah, he didn't, he didn't turn into the wind. So you also have to know where the wind, or general idea. Yep. I mean, just kind of in general direction. It's just as long as you're not going that way, if the wind's coming this way. Yeah. If you're within 90 degrees, it's probably cool, but, um, or no, he wants you like, oh, you should have known. It's, I mean, if it's coming from 270, I mean, if you're in like 24 or 30, like that's pretty good, but. I wouldn't go, you know, because 90 degrees, that means that, oh, I'm aiming south and it's coming from the west. No, that's the totally wrong direction. No, okay. So I would Within say... Within 45 degrees. Yeah, about 45 degrees. I mean, just, in, you know... It, it's not a perfect science, right? Yeah, like but as long not, as you were kind of in the... You had it... At least you were thinking of it. Yeah. 